Hello Stanford and welcome to our student spotlight. My name is Nina and today we have two amazing students and we want to showcase their leadership skills through the Gin Club. Could you please introduce yourselves and tell us about your initiative? Hi, I'm Nandita and I'm a grade 12 student and I'm the co-president of the Gin Club. So pretty much as part of the Global Issues Network, we pretty much empower students to create, like find global issues they're really passionate about and work towards their goals of creating like positive change towards them, whether it be just raising awareness or raising money through fundraisers like we've done before. Essentially, we just want to empower everyone's voice in finding a global issue they're really passionate about and just working towards that goal. So hello, my name is Matthias. I'm one of the leaders of the Gin Club. Recently, we did a, a bake sale in collaboration with the Adams Family Play and all the funds raised were uh, donated to Rare Disorder Society Singapore, which is um, an association that helps in research for rare disorders. And so we, we wanted to do this to support the play and secondly to also donate to an association. So how did you guys come up with your project and what was the public's response to it? You know, tell me all the details, I'm so intrigued. So pretty much last year we did a bake sale where it was pretty much about anti-stress and we did it towards the end of May to kind of like combat that kind of stress related with finals. So we had like a really good outcome of that and we kind of wanted to replicate it this year. So we collaborated with the Adams family and also with the Rare Disorder Society and kind of started from there because one of our club members was really passionate about that so we wanted to take that further and kind of emulate the bake sale once again and the public's response was pretty good like we got so much uh, like engagement from like all students and staff and I think we raised like almost two thousand dollars which is pretty great. Uh, so do you have any special messages or plans for the future? Uh, so we just want to like wish our new leaders of the Gin Club like good luck and we know we've like done a couple projects before and we hope they can like continue this legacy. So what's some advice you have for students who want to start their own initiative and create some community projects? Yeah so I think the first step is to uh, come up with a an idea, uh, something that the students really believe in, and then possibly create a project or a club or, yeah, in order to actually implement the idea and uh, take action. All right, I'm so excited to see your next project and I hope you all caught their tips and now you can start your own community projects. See you for our next Student Spotlight.